Despite some encouraging economic news today, not all working Americans are feeling a positive impact. Many millennials are still struggling financially, especially when compared to past generations. NBC News has confirmed uh, that North Korea, North Korea has fired a ballistic missile. Right now, a whole lot of people are caught literally between countries. Many believe they cannot go back to in a country that says it doesn't want them. They're on a bridge. This is new video on the border between Guatemala and Mexico trying to make their way into Mexico or for some, the United States. This morning, President Trump defiant as the special counsel investigation ramps up, saying during an interview with Fox News on Sunday, he would not overrule his acting attorney general, Matthew Whitaker, if he decides to curtail the special counsel investigation into Russian meddling. It's going to be up to him. Uh, I think he's very well aware politically. I would not get involved. Our country is in the middle of an extreme crisis, a crisis that threatens our foundation. A crisis that threatens the values we all hold, hold dear. A crisis created to blind us to the truth. America is divided. As we fight and bicker, we push each other away. Republicans and Democrats. The left and the right. Family against family. So. In a time like this, we need something to rally behind. We need something to agree on. We need... To tweet at Sadie Robertson to unblock me. Hey, what's going on guys? I'm MT Birchfield. Today we are back with uh, what I consider to be a pretty funny uh, video. A lot of people at my church didn't think it was that funny, but I think it's hilarious. So uh, the other night, as you can see on my screen, I was on Twitter and I was blocked by Sadie Robertson. And you might be wondering, why in the world were you blocked by Sadie Robertson? Well, to be specific, I really don't know. It just kind of happened. Um, here, let me see if I can go back uh, to where we were at. We'll go to my media. Sorry, ex excuse that face right there. Um, let's see here. Let's see. Let's see. Here we go. Okay. So, Sandy Robertson had tweeted out. She said, "If you were a gas station snack, which snack would you be?" So, me and all of my hilarity, uh, I answered and I said, "Oh, the gas station sushi," because no one wants to try me. And put a little laughing emoji, you know, thinking, this is an obvious joke. It's going to be funny. But apparently, it's enough to get you blocked. It's, so, I didn't really know what happened. Um, I tweeted this. I was like, I uh, didn't know why I was blocked. But, you know, I just thought it was a joke. Apparently, 21 people. And for those of you watching, I'm a youth pastor. I didn't mean this in, like, any bad way. I don't really know how you could take that in a bad way. But uh, apparently, 21 people thought it was funny. I went back to check the... Uh, to check the uh, tweet and Sadie Robertson had blocked me. So that's, I guess, I, I don't know if I hit a nerve or what I'm guessing is actually happened was somebody um, who helps to run the social media account because she's got millions of followers and she doesn't have time to respond to everything. Saw it, I don't know if their mind was in the gutter, if they took it wrong the wrong way. I'm not exactly sure, but they blocked me. And so I'm not blocked on Instagram. I can still, still see all her stuff. I sent a message on there, which I know was like super duper long shot to ever get in contact with her or anybody from her social media, social media uh, platform. But uh, I'm not mad. I'm, I'm not upset about this. I thought it was really funny. And uh, I got to share it with a bunch of people um, at my church and now on YouTube because I thought this was hilarious. But you know what? We have to end this injustice. We have to fight back. And so what we're going to do is I want you to all go and I want you to uh, tweet at Sadie Robertson and say, hey, free my boy, MT Birchfield 18. He did nothing wrong. I don't even care what you say. For those of you who are wondering, I don't really think of that as like anything bad. I don't really know what I said that could be misconstrued as bad, but I do find it super duper funny. And uh, it's something that my church family has been laughing at me for all along because it's the first time I've ever tweeted at her and she instantly blocked me. So I'm not really sure what's going on. But if you want to start the hashtag free Matt, that's cool. Um, I will be very appreciative. I do use a lot of her stuff for our youth groups events and studies and things like that. So, you know, it'd be nice to be able to see it all again. And uh, this has been a really interesting time but uh thank you so much for watching the video i just wanted to let everybody know that sadie 
has me blocked on Twitter and I'm not really sure why. So if this reaches you, Sadie, please know that I think you're hilarious, funny, really pretty. You wanna go out sometime? Hey, shoot. Hit me up in my DMs. But uh, that'll be it for the video today. Thank y'all for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye.